So before we start, I just want to tell you a little bit about me. So I, I present a programme called The Chrissy B Show on Sky TV. And Sharon is a regular guest on my programme, helping parents um, how, to, you know, how to help their children and things like that. Now, before with me, I used to be very sad. I used to have something called depression. I was very sad all the time. I was very scared. I was afraid, for example, to turn the lights off at night. I was very nervous all the time. And I didn't know what to do. And I thought, maybe I'm the only one in the whole world that feels this way. And I really thought I was the only one. And I used to have things like nightmares and stuff like that. And it was really affecting my life so much that it caused problems in my family. It caused problems when I was studying and it, it hurt me in so many ways. But, and I tried to get help. I, eventually I did speak to someone. I spoke to my parents and they took me to the doctor and that started um, the process of recovery for me. I found a great place that really helped me. I was able to beat all of my problems and today I'm very happy. And now I do a show that helps other people to be happy as well. So the, the main thing that we want to leave with you today is that if you are feeling sad about anything, if you're scared about anything, if you feel worried, it's really good to talk to someone. You don't have to keep it inside. No one's going to be angry with you or upset with you or disappointed in you. Don't keep it inside because when it's kept inside, it can get really bad, can't it, Sharon? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. definitely. So I know Sharon introduced the MHD challenge to you. Who knows what it stands for? What does MHD stand for? Let's see. you. Yes, brilliant. Mental health dance challenge, okay. And as you saw in the, in the dance, we had some moves in there that mean different things. Who can tell me one of the moves? Yes, you. Which one? Yeah, that one means no. Yeah, brilliant. Well done. Another one. Yeah. Yes, so we had that, the punch one, yeah? So as I keep saying, in all the schools that I go to, we're not punching people, are we? No, that's not good. <laughs> what are we punching? The problems, the depression, the feeling, the bad feelings that come. We're saying, no, I'm not going to leave this feeling there. I'm going to do something about it. Anything else? Yes, the red flag. Where's the red flag? We're going to give those two in a second, okay? It's like it's saying, depression, I'm coming after you. It's red. We're angry at depression. So I can see you all know the basic, the reason why we're doing the dance, okay? Now, you've been practicing, haven't you? Yes. Do you know the whole thing? Yeah. They know the whole thing, Sharon. Fantastic. Shall we? Shall we practice? Yeah. yeah. Okay, everybody, stand up. Here's an attitude. This way. Go. And turn. Stop and crush. Stop and crush. So here are two of the students that took part in the MHD challenge. Why do you think it's important for, for children to take part in something like this? Well, I think it's more important because of the actual mental health, not like going on the telly, like the mental health part, because it's quite important. Like if you just ignore it, then a lot of bad things could happen. Mental health is quite important to your body and what you like. It's also a bad part for your actual health because maybe like you'll just sit at home alone. That's causing you to be lazy. So it just causes lots of things. So when you first heard about the MHD challenge when Sharon introduced it to you, what did you think? It was just like something, I thought it would just be something that would just for like PE. Yeah. Or just something to get our fitness levels up. And when you realised what it was, what it was for, what did you think? It's kind of cool. Cool. <laughs> kind of cool, okay. And how about you, what did you think of the dance? Uh, I thought that it was fun. Mm -hmm. And when I first heard of it, I was thinking like, I want to do it. Okay. How long did it take for you to learn? Um, about a couple of lessons. Okay, that's good. 
And, and when you first heard about the dance, what did you think? When I first heard of it, I thought it wasn't going to be good, but it turned out to be fun. And do you think it's important for other children to take part, and, and why? Yes, because everyone has mental health, and, and everyone needs to feel good. Ready, let's go! And two! Good! And two! Hand on head! Two! One, two, three, get out! Stop! To the side! To the side, but it's a punch. Punch, punch, down. Punch, 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 down, down. Let's go again. This way. Stop, stop, stop. Step back and point and wave. Well, everyone, I'm very proud to present this certificate of participation for the MHD challenge. Warrendell have done an amazing job today. They got really stuck in, they really understood what the dance was about and I'm so, so happy to have come here today with Sharon to present this certificate. So well done, well done. <laughs> Stay tuned.